Okay, everybody. Welcome back to the show. Alright, let's start with the briefing. As we can see, Gallus is more than a little bloodlustful. Yeah, but I'm afraid asking Gallus to, is to hold back is like asking a nun not to pray. Anyways, let's go to the interview section. Ugh. What's it going to take for me to get Devlin out of that green zone? It's ridiculous. Ugh. Anyway, let's get out of there. If there's any one character that will prevent you from getting the good ending, it's him. Alright, now that we've saved and we're all ready to go, let's start the show... ...proper. Right. Okay. So, of course, we have Radcon himself. Oh, God. Never! Yeah, don't worry, folks. We will not. We will not be losing this time. Oh no! Love that burn by Zyra. It's triple chins. It's true too. Just take a look at that. At that shot there. He's definitely got triple chins. This man is a sick fuck. Hello, Nana. Surprise! Even amongst those who haven't, who haven't played this game yet, um... Were you really surprised? This is the one reaction uh, of Radcon that, considering all things, is probably somewhat justified. If I thought someone had kidnapped my daughter like that, I'd probably be... I'd probably be pretty pissed too. Yeah, it's a good tactical move, but we're kind of we're kind of a little too morally upright for that. Yeah, then how about showing it on the interview screen and stop screwing up my chances of getting the good ending, bastard? Yeah, sometimes, no matter how tempting, you just gotta do the right thing. And Nana does try to strike up a deal for us. But what are the chances of Radcon actually keeping his promise, even for his daughter? So Nana scampers across the battlefield, gets in the Bahamut, And, well, do you want to guess what happens next? Yeah. This man deserves a kick in the balls. With steel toe boots. So yeah, at least now we can get we get to kill the soldiers. 
Okay, first of all, let's take a closer look at Andrew, because he is now officially controllable. The Fettel Corbon, I believe, is the only Ninja 8 tech in the game. However, for now, at least, we will not be raising him. And I think, yes, I believe Zyra has gone up a couple levels since the last battle he participated in, so... He's been, he's been scaled up a little bit. Like he really needed it. God. Already, he's already a, a beast. Okay, now, what makes the stage really easy is that the muscle soldiers will actually come at you in waves. They will not come at you all at once. Thereby making this stage really, really easy as long as you don't get overly aggressive. So we'll just hold a line here. Uh, counter chances aren't that great, so we'll just avoid the attack here. For some reason, they're using, some of the soldiers here are using Andorra's Type 8 attacks, which you might recognize from the two bandit, two bandit stages that we fought. So, Radcott must have ran out of the Rabahor Atex. I think that's what they're called. Anyway. Another thing that's really helpful in this stage is that we don't have... that we're not on their turf anymore. So, our mobilities are about... are about even now. There's no equipment advantages to anybody in this stage. Okay, so as usual, I'll have Gavlis step in and provide support. Remember, he doesn't stay with us the entire game, so we're not going to let him get a whole lot of kills here. If any! And let's give this guy a fireball to the back. Welcome to the battlefield. I hope you have a good time. Okay, let's make good use of Andrew's assassinate ability. Alright, Barlow, get in there and kick his ass. Aw, oh, damn it. Aw, oh, you gotta be kidding me! Yeah, we. It doesn't. It's not strong enough, his strong slice, to be able to take those guys out. So I think I'd try going on the other side here and see if I can do it that way. But I don't have the AP to do it, so I'll just say, screw it, let's try to tackle him. Just slightly under half ch half chance here, but we get him anyway. Yes, good job, Barlow. Now that's how you run somebody over. And he gets a level up as a reward. Ain't life grand? Okay. The video is going to end right here, folks, but when we come back, we'll finish the we'll finish off this first wave.